Hey guys, what's up? It's Vape Tech Uncut back again with another video. Today I'm going to be showing you what's in my tech bag. This is going to be the weekend edition. So we are going to the balloon fiestas for the weekend and I thought maybe I would do a video of what's in my tech bag. So what am I going to take with me or with us to this balloon fiesta? So let's just start with the stuff we have showing here and then I'll show you everything in the backpack. So first we have the Galaxy S7 Edge. Gotta take that with me. This is always on me. So there's that. And then we have my mod. I always have to have my e-cig with me. Okay, now that we've got those out of the way, let's go ahead and take a look at the bag itself. So here's the bag. It's the OGO and it is the new T13. And this is what houses all of my tech stuff. Uh, this is the backpack I used when I was in college and it's a pretty good sleek backpack actually and it fits so much you're going to see I have this packed up pretty full because uh, we're going to need a lot of stuff for this weekend. So the backpack itself has some very nice padding on the back so it's super comfortable. The shoulder straps are very padded and comfortable. It has the clip so you can clip it around the front so that way you know it's nice and tight and secure. It has the handle up top, tons of compartments. Here's a compartment here and we'll check that out in a second. We have some compartment, a uh, sneaky compartment in the back there. The main compartment, a little top compartment, and then the front compartment. So pretty big, nice backpack. So let's take a look at what's inside. With the very front pocket, opening it up, I have the wireless charging or a wireless charging pad. It's from Chi Infinity. And this is just a 4000 milliamp and it has one USB port and then it charges up wirelessly. I like to keep this around, uh, especially when we go on trips and stuff, just for a quick charge or not even a quick charge because it doesn't charge it quickly, but just to get me through the day. And it's convenient because I can just put my phone right on top of it and I'm good to go. The second item I have in the front pocket is my iPod. This is a very old iPod. I don't even remember the generation of it, but super old iPod, but it houses tons and tons and tons of my old music that I still enjoy listening to. So I keep this around um, just because it holds so much of my old songs. And when I get bored of the music on my phone, or with Spotify, but who can get bored of Spotify? So it doesn't get used much, but it's good to have because I like to go back, throw back Thursdays. The third item I have in that pocket is the Omad carabiner clip. So this one is the USB to micro USB charging cable. So I like to keep this around because again, it's super convenient. I can clip it onto anywhere and charge up my phone or my mods or whatever we have. So that is all I carry in the first pocket. So on the very top small pocket I have just a battery case. So it's a power case for the Galaxy S7 Edge. This is a 5000 milliamp power case and this is really nice because if we're gonna go out and my phone is dying or dead, I can throw my phone on this and put it in my pocket and I'm good to go. It has a kickstand so that way if we're out somewhere and we want to watch a video or whatever, there we go. So I like to keep that around with me. Let's see, I also have a pen because you never know when you need a pen. So I have that in the big middle pocket. I have the Truly Wireless Losong. Still don't know if I'm pronouncing those right, but the, the, the Truly Wireless 
earbuds. So I like to keep these around. Most of the time I only wear one so that way I can still talk to my wife and listen to YouTube or my music. So I like to keep those and I keep the charging cable in there with it. And then we have the 4K, the Ultra 4K HD action camera. So I did do a video or an unboxing video of this and I like to carry this around with me now because I'm testing it out. I want to do somewhat of a review or a, I don't know, a review against the Git 2 and I have a couple more coming in. I, I want to just see the quality and price range and stuff like that. So carry this around in case we need it. We like to shoot little things. so and I keep it in the housing. We also have a selfie stick, gets pretty long. And we're going to the Balloon Fiesta, so more than likely I'm taking the action camera with the selfie stick, so that way we can check out all the balloons and see all the concerts and be able to film everything that's there. I'm also going to take the mini Gorillapod with the uh, ball head. I'm going to take this because you never know when you're going to need that either. I have just a cheap mouse for my MacBook so that's going to go with us. So keep in mind most of this stuff is in the middle compartment so the big compartment. So I have this Sanhu. It's just a organizer pretty much for all of our stuff. So here we have our external hard drive. It's a one terabyte, I think. I have a power brick that has two USB ports just so that way I can charge up two of our devices at the same time. And then a bunch of power cables, USB, micro USB. Let's see. This side I have the little flash drive, an aux cord, microfiber cleaning cloth. I have a, I think this is a 16 gigabyte flash drive. Yeah. Here. And then we have some of the, I have a couple of these actually. So some of the adapters for the SD cards, especially because we're going to be filming a lot with the action camera. And then we have some extra, uh, down here we have some extra memory cards. And then in this little compartment that's supposed to be for SD cards, I have the SIM injection tool. So that, that's pretty much what we keep in here. So that has everything that we'll need to keep everything powered, which is very, very important. The next item that I have in the middle compartment this is my EC Technology power bank. So love to keep this thing around. Um, it's what we use to charge up pretty much everything. This is my this is my heavy my big boy. <laughs> I call this my big boy. So this is let's see 2,000 or 22,400 milliamp. So it pretty much charges everything. And I keep it in this case with a couple of USB to micro USB charging cables. And keep that nice and good in there. Then I think this is our last item in the middle compartment. We have the Soul, the Motorola Soul deck. So always nice to bring a Bluetooth speaker around because you know, we just like to listen to music all the time. Even even at the balloon fiestas or any of the fiestas that we go to, it's nice to just sit around and eat, especially if we don't like the music they're playing. So we're going to take this. We can use it in the hotel. Stuff like that. So we keep that. Let's see. Oh, yeah. The last thing in the middle compartment is our Galaxy Tab. So this is a little bit older. This is the Tab 3. 
and it just comes in handy because we can just do little searches and look up some YouTube videos. Whatever we need that's not super crazy, we can do on the Galaxy Tab. That's it for the middle compartment. All right, in the back compartment, the one that touches your back, I house my 13 inch MacBook Pro. So I, I keep this thing with me pretty much everywhere. I try to, well, only if we're staying overnight and stuff like that, but I try not to take it where we're just going out for the day or somewhere crazy. But if we're going somewhere that has Wi-Fi, I like to take it with me. And last but not least, there is a sneaky apartment or a sneaky compartment in the back of the backpack and that I keep an extra mod and I also keep a microfiber cleaning cloth. So just to keep everything nice and clean and that is it. All that is housed in the Ogeo backpack. So that's about it. This is what we are taking on our weekend trip to the Balloon Fiesta and seems like a lot but it's pretty much everything that we're going to use and it's everything that we usually do use so this stays the same if it's just like a weekend trip. Anywho, I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you got a good look at all of our cool stuff. Stay tuned for the vlog. I'll be doing a vlog of the Bloom Fiesta so make sure you catch that. Anyways, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, make sure you dab the like button. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. And we will see you in the next video. Bye!